so um, coming up next, this is a real pleasure to have um, these guys here. Um, the Comedy Poop Co Podcast, sorry, let's say it again, the Comedy Poop Podcast. Um, they've been running, I think, for about a year or so, um, doing really good stuff. Um, this is the first ever performance of their first ever full length live show. So please welcome the Comedy Poop Podcast with Flamingo Burlesque. because he's poor. We can see you in the back garden jumping around with your trifle on a bouncy castle. <laughs> Lame. Well, they should never use that classic excuse. Ooh, he's off with his chum, swinging nice. his conkers around valiantly and touching each other in a bit to make a cultural impact on future audiences. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you okay? <laughs> Yes, I'm just getting a little bit annoyed, really. I can't believe what's calling me. Boiling me, telling me. Your mum was a weirdo. She was. You have to admit, she was slightly weird. Ah, oh, but if you think weird is sewing your children's school uniforms out of your own bodily hair, then she was slightly weird. <laughs> I don't know how to that weird. That was pretty Yeah, she, pretty weird. She was pretty um, nice. <laughs> Uh, to be honest, I'm not actually liking the way this is, uh, show is going right now. Mm. We, we didn't intend it to be like this. We had like a cool musical number and everything. Yeah, uh, no, would you mind if, if we just start getting these? Yeah, let's yeah. do the dancing thing. It's the one that you It's the one Oh, I have now. Hi, I'm Pete Butler, a graduate of the University of Creative Arts and uh, inventor of the mobile phone top-up system, although I was never given the credit I deserved. <laughs> <laughs> 
that you could yeah. <laughs> And I'm Lucy Burgess, princess in the making and part to our bed Norwich's first cat prostitution ring. We've got cheap, slutty, pink cats for every occasion. <laughs> And I'm Pete Brent, discoverer of 17 types of mould and keeper of the jar of a thousand tears. Uh, I bought tears, not um, tears. Uh, anyway, this is. Flamingo! Burlesque! Believe me, I do. So just, just stick tight. It'll be fine. Don't worry. Oh, we'll be fine. Oh, Sorry about that. Right. Um. Ah. Uh, Have you 
heard of this? No. Uh, well, it's very good. But it's, uh, the best way to let an employee know if they're doing something wrong is to establish negative criticism between two positive answers. What? Ah, yes, it's very, uh, yes. I'll show you, and then you can try. Well, now, Mr. Ian Cooper, please come to the manager's office. Thank you. Okay, so Ian's going to be here in a minute. I'll just run through how we do the management sandwich and then come with the manager. And uh, then you can try it out. Ah, Ian. Hi, Ian. Come in. Sit down. Hi. You alright? Please. How are you? Alright, we got what we do. Yeah, we got what we do. Just stop going. Jammer? Certainly not. I don't know. Adam, would you like a jammer? Oh, um, uh, okay. Fine. Mmm, what a Is there a problem here? No, not good, but I don't know. Yeah, I'm not rich. Now here, my clothes are better because I've noticed that you're doing really well on the shop floor. And I wanted to bring you up and thank you personally for all your effort and hard work, you know, Well, thank you very much. Thank you for nice to give that feedback, you know. You're doing all your work every day. If that's a bit, it's about your BS! You smell worse than little flats under the Elven Man's water. Stop it out! Look at that, Ian. I think that you've got skills to go a long way with this business. I love you, Ian. Sorry. What? What's going on here? I love you, I bloody love you. Got everything you'd like in this place up and just stops me from punching some shit like when I'm afraid of that. We love you. Tell me you love him, Hannah. I love you, Ian. I don't understand. I mean, I could probably pick up some links on the way back. Links? Oh, that would be great. You'll be fighting off the women if you could, Ian. That would be sad. Go, Ian, go! Oh, thanks. I mean, it's nice to have you doing a good job, you know. No, go, Ian, leave. You even look like a champ. That shit isn't that. <coughs> right, I'll normally not have that. I'll take myself to a, a, a management truck. Right, now you try. Stop announcements. Could Jeanette's building please come to the management office? Thank you. Okay, so Jeanette will be here in a minute. Can I tell her with a smile? Oh, no, no. They like that. Darling. I the feel of it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, Jeanette. Darling. Come in, please. Have a seat. How are you? I'm not feeling very well, but oh. I'm not feeling down. Oh, it's your nails. Uh, Jeanette, they're fabulous. What colour do you call that? Well, that's blood. Oh, that's a fabulous shade of red. Uh, you know, you're very beautiful. Woman. But we, we do have one or two issues with your hair. You need to be more aggressive. Aggressive! <coughs> Jeanette, what's with your hair? This is a disgrace. That's much better. Either you dye it back or we'll shave it off. It's strict store policy to not have outrageously dyed hair. It's not the thing, it's actually But you know, you know, we love the work you do here. And your smile, darling. You know, life is up even the darkest of the room. I love you, Jeanette. We both love you. It's only if there were more Jeanette oh. in the world. <laughs> I don't really understand. Can I just go to the hospital now? I'm feeling very faint. Did you finish your shift first? Well, I don't know, really. I've got a lot of blood missing. <laughs> you know what? That's cool, actually. It's probably best that you, you go to the hospital. Um, oh, no interest. Um, <laughs> did you see anyone like driving the car? Did you get any kind of description or detail? Oh, or some kind of part that I've seen these bent. But they bent them then. Oh, that's terrible. I mean, that's oh, do you mind if I just have a quick look at your head? Oh, certainly, yeah. Do you do fasting? I have some kind of. Oh, that's that's terrible. That's really bad. <laughs> Okay, Jeanette, you're good to go. Thank you. Hey, okay, now remember, we love you. Well, thank you very much. Well, oh, oh, that is nice. Do you know how much these things cost to replace? Holly. <laughs>